peace YouTube I was watching this video clip the other day and I found some things interesting about it so I decided to share it with you and share my point of view on a couple of things hopefully you'll find this as interesting as I did and also informational so we're gonna watch it and we're gonna find out who's who and what's what okay and the man you with now by the way when I made this video I made it in full video form he assumes the reader but I had to change Jesus it for the purposes of being able to well, present it to you because when I uploaded it to Bible, YouTube, they blocked the video that's saying that, that uh, okay, now, NBC now, is the now, owner now, of the now, video, now, even though I made the expression that is U.S. law that provides a remedy for copyright material if you're making comments and so forth, which is part of the disclaimer that you just saw. So if you want a copy of this video, you can contact me at leaktheshek at gmail.com, and I'll see to it that you can get a copy of it. All right. Together. Without being married? Without being married. Well, so our, you assume and, and, that everybody and, and, that lives together is in sin. You guys are wrong. I didn't say anything. Okay, didn't okay, say well, stop. For stop, 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 stop. Make the stop, point. stop, stop, stop. Shacking is in the Bible. You won't find the word shacking, but Joseph and Mary actually shacked for a year before they actually got married. Where did he get this heresy from? Well, oh, that's heresy? Oh, stop. That's heresy? That's not, <laughs> that's not truth? Brother, what, what is wrong with him? Is that not true? <laughs> Just answer me, Wayne. Is that not true, man? I understand the right. year-long yeah. trial period. Now, the problem, let me, let me talk to this. But the problem was not the, uh, the yes, my problem was, was that you, you're dipping go. off again go. the police writing tickets that, that you don't, nobody deserves. What you really wanted to ask me was, are you in sin? Are you having sex? Because living with somebody does not mean that you're, you're having sex with them. There are people that live together for various, many different reasons. It could be roommates for many reasons. Yeah, but so, you, so you guys assume, aren't just anybody. To, to make a, I mean, y'all. I mean, y'all. Y'all are people who are intent on getting married. Yeah, and but, but but we weren't shacking. I had my place. You live with the mother, and that's truth. Yeah. Okay. Now, but that's none of your business, though. You, you see what I'm saying? That's none of your business. That's where you go too far. And that's, no, that's what, not true. That's well, what, let me help you out, brother. Personal. Let me help you out, young man. Hold up, no, hold up. If you let me help you out, Detroit. Right? That's what stirred me up. Let me up. help you out, Detroit. Right I got you. Right I got you. No, no, exactly. no, no, Michelle. No, that's no, not the point. You just can't it's jump from A to C because in between B, there was a baby. B as in baby, out of wedlock. Okay? So you're married now. You can't jump from A to C. They weren't married when he had their baby, so if they weren't shacking, no, 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 they were doing no, something. No, 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 stop, stop, He wasn't stop, keeping stop, his rocket stop, in his pocket. Stop, stop. I didn't no. tell... Hold, 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 hold it, brother. We had already had the baby. My sins were but already you weren't forgiven. Married. And it's not for you to pull it up and, and, and judge me. Once God has forgiven it's me, you when already, order. I didn't no, say I didn't you, forgive you. No, you, you ain't got to say nothing, because you... I can say what I want to say. Who are you? out of order. You're out of order, brother. Oh, my. But now listen. I'm the man you, whose business you talking about. And I'm going to keep talking about that's my job to defend the gospel. No, 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 no. Yeah. Brother, you ain't got to defend me, the gospel. I'm not trying to defend you. I'm, I'm not trying to defend you. You guys are making this personal. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. It doesn't need to be personal. Hold we can deal with principle. That's the point. That's the point. The listeners no, need right. to hear about the principle, right. not right. about the personality exactly. and all that stuff. That's the principle so we're talking my about. My question is what is the principle? Or anybody else? spit now. Now, hold up. First and foremost, I find this very interesting that. Yeah, four preachers sitting up here, Christian preachers who study the same book, who are supposed to be ministers of the same gospel and have the ideology of one Savior, one law, and one God. But nevertheless, they can't have an intellectual conversation without arguing. I think that's very interesting. You need to sit back, Miss Lady. You need to sit back. This because man came. trying to keep y'all away from each other. You don't have to do that, Michelle. Here it is. Here we're, it we're is. Not, we're, this is not that, fighting. Here it is. Argument like that. You're out of order again. But I'm gonna call you out on How it. How is it out of order? Wait a minute. I, I know y'all know you're not used to somebody challenging you because you're wearing your collar and you got all that stuff. But I, that, that stuff don't stop Bishop, me from calling Bishop, you out. How is it out of order? Out of order. Okay, How? listen. How do you, can we you please? authority? I worry about the young folks. I agree with you. Speak it up. I worry about the young folks. Right. That is why the topic we need to talk about sex and cohabitation. Thank you. That's what we want to talk about. Why is it seeming to be such a hot 
issue. What do you say to the people? Like you said, people want an answer without all the bickering and all of this stuff. No, no. The Bible says you can get Hold angry, on. but sin not. And I have righteous indignation when you think you can be a Christian man, shack with a woman, and be in a 16 and 17 year relationship oh, oh, without oh, accountability. Oh. Without accountability. I, I don't That's believe that. Yeah, no, well, let's keep well, it. Let's keep it. Listen, listen, listen. No, no, no. It's no sin in living with somebody. The sin is having sex with yeah, somebody. What are you on? Stop. Stop. You're wrong. You're putting out the wrong messages out there, man. When? That's some old, ancient oh, so bull no, crap wait, wait, that's wait, not wait, working. Wait, that's wait, not true, wait. Dude. I want to ask true. you a question on that. You think it's completely acceptable for a guy and a girl to be boyfriend and girlfriend, say, we're not going to have sex, but we're going to roommate together, we're going to sleep in the same bed together, we're going to live together. Not, it's okay to live together. If you sleeping in a bed with somebody and you know you have an affection with, uh, towards them, that's a dangerous place to be. But it's, it's, it's wrong to assume that somebody, because they're living with somebody, well, they're I'm not, insane. I'm not assuming they're No, I'm just saying, what, what, what would you tell, is, is, is what would you tell people? Let me, uh, let me and Dietrich talk for a minute. What kind of precedence would you set? What this would you is what care? I would what tell them, tell them if you were going to my church. Tell me. First of all, I'll find out the situation. There are different reasons why people live together. Sometimes because they financially, they're financially distressed. It's many different reasons. Some people, there was a couple on, online that told me, hey, said I, me and my uh, boyfriend, Shaq, well, living together because we tried to save up. Uh, to get married. So that's so, justifiable? Listen, that's right? Listen, that's then, right? As long as... This that's is what right? I, you she asked me about my church. I just want to hear what he has to say. From a if Christian you're not perspective, having sex, it's all right to live with somebody. Ooh, that's found in the Bible. That's... Bad. I don't agree with that. I don't, I don't agree care with what that. you don't like. Right. I don't care. You set yourself I don't care. Wow. This is what we all know. We all know. Let's get away from the hate sex. Wow. It all right, is all yell. right, right yell. to live with somebody I'm if you're not, not having why, sex. Why, why, if you're you? fornicating, that is the sin. Can That's going to get you in trouble. But living with somebody. Okay, Dietrich right here says that fornicating is the sin. Okay. Now, we're going to go over some scripture out of the book that they're supposed to support and we're going we're going to see if that's true or not hold on all right here we go right here first john chapter 3 verse 4 where it says whosoever committed sin transgresseth also the law for sin is the transgression of the law. Right there, it gives you the definition of sin. It says sin is the transgression of the law. So now the question should be, what law are they talking about? Are they talking about man's law? Are they talking about universal law? Are they talking about spiritual law? What kind of law are they talking about? So let's see if we can find out what kind of law is the transgression associated with okay right here matthew chapter 6 verse 9 where it reads after this manner before pray ye our father which art in heaven hallowed be thy name thy kingdom come thy will be done in earth as it is in heaven give us this day our daily bread and for this is the part I wanted to get to on this and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors it doesn't say forgive us our sins or it doesn't say forgive us our transgressions like they later uh, changed the word debt to transgression but it says forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors Okay, now, why doesn't it say forgive us our sins? If sins were the thing that we were supposed to have been forgiven of, or is sin and debt the same thing? I believe the latter, that sin is actually debt, okay? So whenever you see the word sin, just change that to debt, and I'm going to show you why. Hold on. 